I was, I've just been so, so since sort of Fulham, uh, I was speaking to my family yesterday just about, because I, I barely spoke to them for two weeks, because obviously it's just been so intense. It's just been such high pressured sort of environment. Every We've won so many games, we've ended up putting ourselves in like an unbelievable position. Um, obviously good, we couldn't get it over the line, but you know, I'm, I'm just saying so positive because obviously just to even get in that position, we, we thought it could never happen. Um, Obviously gutted we couldn't, couldn't get it over the line, but obviously just fully focused now on finishing the last normal game of the season really strong and then um, really looking forward to the playoffs. Seeing that you know, all their fans run on the pitch, it is gutting. Um, and you're like, oh, damn, like, do you know what I mean? But we, we quickly get over it because, you know, we've got senior players in the dressing room. Um, you know, we've we've got a really good brunch and, and we're realistic as well. Like we've won nine of the last eleven games, I think it is. Like it's an unbelievable achievement. Um, you know, just to get in the playoffs after the start we've had is is unbelievable. So, you know, we've just got to stay completely focused and and you know look at where we can improve on the game. And you know, it's if anything, you know, it, it's going to put us in good stead for the playoffs because it was such a high pressured game. Um, you know, some of the younger players will, will learn from that experience and hopefully kick on. In, in the playoff games where it is going to be extremely extremely tense but yeah like I say um, we're, we're all in really good spirits and, and fully focused and no no one's downbeat whatsoever the, the manager wouldn't allow that at all anyway um, he knew the situation so you know let, let's crack on you know it's it's a roller coaster being a footballer and my dad says that ever since I've um, ever since I was young, it's it's up and down, and you have to use them them moments to motivate you, um, to make you better players, um, and we'll certainly do that. I think, you know, the manager spoke to us this morning, um, really upbeat, just saying, you know, it's given him so much confidence. That first half, we were the better team, created the better chances. Um, you know, it didn't it didn't go away for whatever reason, um, and you know, we we didn't perform as well as we should have second half, but. You know, it gives us so much confidence going forward. Um, you know, congratulations to them. But you know, we've just got to reflect, learn on that, and and go again. I I certainly am because I think it's exciting. Um, you know, we we want to, but only only because you know we want to finish as strong as possible. You know, we we want to win the last game. Um, you know, if he makes a few changes, players are going to want to play really well, and it's just going to improve the whole squad. Um, we'll, we'll see what happens, but I'm I'm fully excited. I'm not not thinking about it too much. Um, the manager always speaks about the whole process. Um, you know, sticking to our plan and and how the way we play, we're never going to divert and under high high pressure situations. Sticking to his philosophy and the way he wants us to play, and you know, we're, we're just really excited more than anything. You know, especially the second leg of the city ground, it's going to be special.